trichotillomania. And trichotillomania is essentially a psychiatric disorder that consists of recurrent pulling out of hair. And this results in a patient having hair loss, but in patches um, on their scalp. And also, other parts of the body can also be without hair because of all this pulling out, such as the eyebrows or eyelids sometimes as well. Now, why would somebody develop this? What is the reason somebody would start pulling out their hair? Well, when they have studied this, they find a correlation with tension and stress and anxiety as being the causative factor. And when the person pulls out their hair, they get a feeling of relief. An interesting epidemiological factor is that 90% are female. In terms of symptomatology, of course, the most common or the most obvious is the hair pulling. But then also, some patients will also swallow the hair. Now, if they do, that has a special name. It's called trichophagia. And this can lead to some pretty significant problems because the hair can get stuck in the intestine and the hair cannot be digested. And that can result in devastating consequences. Some patients will cover the hair loss, of course, with uh, wigs. And very important is that sometimes the patient will have a coexisting psychiatric disorder, such as depression or anxiety. And that needs to be addressed. In terms of diagnosis, really, there's no test. It's just clinical. And you really know that this has become a significant problem when the patient has lost control and can no longer cope with it without some intervention. In terms of treatment, they have found that SSRIs, selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, or a medication known as clomipramine have helped. Now clomipramine is a TCA, which is a tricyclic antidepressant. And this medication is particularly useful if there is a coexisting depression along with the trichotillomania. So that needs to be addressed. And there is a type of behavior therapy known as cognitive behavior therapy that is also beneficial in treating these patients. And what cognitive behavior therapy does is it helps to identify the triggers of why somebody would start pulling their hair and then also works with the patient on stimulus control. So now let's take a look at a couple vignettes. 16 year old female presents to your office for treatment of her hair pulling. She reports a depressed mood, significant hair loss. Problem developed at age 10 when she would pull hair when she was upset about her parents fighting and when feeling sad, lonely, or bored. She reported that she usually pulled her hair without thinking or when under stress related to school, family, and relationship problems. Sometimes, however, she reported a significant urge to pull with some relief when she engaged in the behavior. At those times, she found the hair pulling enjoyable. Most likely diagnosis is. Well, it's a classic clinical vignette for trichotillomania, and it also fits the 90% female and then also there's a very important part of this clinical vignette how she has relief after she engages in the behavior. And the last one, an 18 year old girl is brought to the clinic because she periodically pulls her hair and puts it in her mouth. She has several bald patches on both sides of her head. Initially the mother thought it was some sort of infection but the dermatologist did not find anything. The patient describes a sense of relief when she does it and claims that she really does it when upset, anxious, or overwhelmed. She admits that she has been doing it on and off for about two years and thinks it started after her parents got divorced. She is doing well in school. Which of the following is the most appropriate initial step in management? Okay. This answer choice is the first one I thought of, but it may be the appropriate treatment, such as clomipramine, 
is a tricyclic antidepressant. But you really need to figure out if she has any comorbid conditions first, such as depression and other psychiatric conditions. So that would be the initial step. So really the wording of the question is very important. So the answer is C.